Welcome back to Recipes Tested. I'm Brianna Robinson and today you requested and I am testing a pinwheel recipe and this was one that just popped up on my Facebook and it is from hernadoalley.com. The link will be down in the description below because I'm probably butchering how to pronounce that name but this looks like a really easy one. I've actually never made pinwheels before so I didn't want to get too in over my head and make something like super extravagant. And this one just looks really good. It has a lot of really great reviews too. So if you guys want to see how this recipe turns out, just keep watching and I'll get testing. So my first step was getting my ham out. So I just got some deli ham and just sliced it, diced it into itty bitty little pieces so that I can throw it in my bowl. And then I did the same thing with my pickle. I had pickle spears and just one dill pickle left. So I just cut my pickle up and just diced it and then threw that in my bowl as well and just cut enough to make it for what the recipe called for. And the slices were much easier, like it was way quicker with those. And then I got my softened cream cheese and did the best that I could to, you know, make it spreadable, basically. It kinda, I don't know, I had way too small of a bowl and my stirring device was way too small so it wasn't <laughs> going, but then I added it to my big bowl and I tried to stir it around and it, it worked, but the pickles were really soft and the cream cheese wasn't super whipped so it didn't really mix that well. I had to spend a good a little bit of time, but once it did finally all combine, and I went and just got my tortillas and put my mixture on it and then spread it out evenly. And it was hard for me not to add any seasoning the whole time. I was like, I want to add garlic or pepper or something, but I stuck to the recipe and I just did it the way that it said. And I rolled the pinwheels up into, I don't know, I just rolled them all up and then cut them into half inch little pieces. And once they were all cut, I just plated them up. So that's pretty quick and easy. I am going to give it a taste and let you know if it's love at first bite. I'm actually really surprised. I honestly thought these were gonna be so bland and boring, but they're really good. I did not refrigerate these for an hour and I am really kind of glad that I didn't because the cream cheese is really nice and creamy and it kind of balances out the like kind of salty bite from the ham and that pop of pickle flavor. This is a really actually really nice appetizer and that was so easy. It's gonna be pretty inexpensive depending on what kind of ham you get. And I know at least for me, we usually always have these ingredients on hand. So I give this a 10 out of 10. This was easy, quick, and it's really great for a last minute appetizer for any party that you may want, need to go to or if you're asked to bring something, I recommend giving this a try because it's so simple and I think even kids and adults will love it alike. So give me a thumbs up if you think that you would like it too. And don't forget to leave any requests down in the comments below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe bell button and bell. <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mm -mm. Thank you.